As though summoned by some great chief, the clouds form over the Cook Strait, heading to the capital of the nation, the place where the leaders of this country lead, talk, do their thing. And we, the people, always wonder what's happening. I look up to the sky and I look around in the evening at the last light as the last light is disappearing over the ridge leading up to Mount Kau Kau. The sun rays shine on the wind-blowing clouds painting pictures over Johnsonville. There's a peace in my heart, a feeling of whole, as I watch the clouds paint pictures, wind blown by God to create a picture, clouds yelling out to us saying, look at me, look at me, it's beautiful, nature is beautiful, creation is beautiful, God made this for you, made it for me, a place that we can enjoy. And remember, once it's all over, you'll find more beauty in eternity. Yes, I know it seems that it cries a lot, the clouds. They shed their tears to things happening down here. Nature doesn't always enjoy what we do. We have to get through and the understanding that we love, we love each other. We can love the world and God's creation, but somehow it doesn't always work that way. That terrible thing called money, ego, power gets in the way, and yet clouds, that last light of night shining over a ridge in Johnsonville, on the hill of Mount Cow Cow tells us that everything can be all right. It is obvious to me without clouds in the sky Seeds wouldn't grow and rivers wouldn't flow. Plants wouldn't grow and we wouldn't know what the sea would look like without clouds. Without clouds. Without clouds. Nothing would grow.